everyone! Welcome back to my channel. This is Ivana and for this video, I decided to do my glam makeup tutorial. And this is the look that I do for all of my big events, for special occasions, for tapings, for my guestings. This is my go-to makeup look and if you have any special occasions coming through, I'm sure you're gonna learn something from this. I'm gonna start out by applying sunscreen. I already applied this to my face and this is really good and it's affordable and it lasts you a long long time i'm gonna apply lip balm because my lips are so dry that's what happens when you don't have anyone to make out with huh for my primer this is what i use the guerlain gold primer but this is my favorite i've tried so many other primers and i'm really oily and sometimes i'm dry like i don't understand my face really But at the end of the day, this is what works for me. And you should really find a primer that works with your skin. This is the foundation that I use. It's by La Mer. It's the Soft Fluid Longwear Foundation. I use this. It's expensive, yeah. I mean, it's worth it. It's my investment for my skin. If you guys want, I can look for a drugstore one, which is nice, and I can do another video on that. sure that you have everything but I do foundation ano ba to? shape tape concealer I have some pimples over here at the side it's not pimples but it's like red pimples na nga lang hirapan ko pa sa ko The sides of my nose so what that does is it gives the illusion of having like a smaller nose for me and then we're gonna blend everything in all of my guestings on the TV I've done my makeup and this is the makeup that I do always like this is my go-to you put too much eyeliner on my face it makes me look more stronger looks It starts to change. And honestly, I don't like that. I just like to enhance what I have right here. Instead of being a makeup artist, I just invested in my makeup and skincare. Because skincare is really important. Like toner, night cream, moisturizer. Because if you don't have like a good base to start with, it's gonna be really hard for you to have like a nice outcome. At night, take care of your skin, remove your makeup. You know whenever I'm drunk, like really, really drunk and I'm crazy. Like, I don't even remember. I feel like something else takes over my body. But it's so funny. It's like a whole new different personality. But I love that person because she still removes her makeup. <laughs> In the Laura Mercier translucent powder. And I make sure that I blend everything so when I put the powder, it's not gonna cake up. I take a little more extra and I just apply it underneath my eyes. This is for all of the fallouts of the eyeshadow that we're gonna be using. And this is also to kind of bake. And I'm gonna show you one of my tricks to make my face look smaller. I take some on the sponge and then I include this. 
And then I'm gonna leave that there. We're gonna remove that later. Now we're gonna move into our eyes. I'm using the Fenty Beauty Eye Primer. Using my favorite palette. I'm also gonna be using this palette. This is the Skin Deep by NARS. I'm gonna take this and this by NARS and we're gonna work it into the crease. I have to extend it to the outer V of my eye just to make it look bigger, but it's already big. I take a clean brush and I just fix the edges because sometimes it's a bit too harsh. Just so it looks nicely blended. I'm using Luscious by the Peach Palette. And what I like to do is I like to take Evian. I like to spray my eyeshadow brush. I just feel like whenever you wet it, the pigment comes out so much nicer. some more brown eyeshadow for the crease. I like having a matte crease. So for my lower lash line, I'm taking Georgia and Caramelized by this palette. And I'm just going to smoke out my lower lash line. I'm using this one by Hourglass. Cream eyeshadow, glitter eyeshadow and smoke. O baka feeling ko lang. But I like to just pat this on. It's so nice. It just makes the color look so nice. I don't really put eyeliner. I just use an eyeshadow to line my eyes. This one's by NARS again, the same palette. This dark brown over here. So for eyeliner, I just like to use this kind of brush. And then, we're gonna wet it. Now we're gonna go into eyebrows. I'm using the Brow Wiz by Anastasia. And what I do is I just fill in my eyebrow. I do have a scar here which I always have to fill in. It's because my sister slammed my face on the wall <laughs> and they had to do like stitches on it. everything with my brow wiz by Anastasia also. For my hourglass, ooh, you can see my camera using this color right here. So I'm putting this in my ooh, my muta, my inner tear ducts. And then we're also gonna apply that on our brow bone. And I'm just gonna
gonna curl my lashes. Sometimes I do put um, false lashes. <laughs> Estee Lauder, it's the Zero Smudge Lengthening Mascara. My favorite mascara is by Maybelline. I'm gonna clean the powder that we kept on the under eye. by contouring my face this is what I really like using and I use this kind of brush so it's like a flat fluffy brush what I do with my nose is I just ooh, contour the sides with a little too much and then I bring it up to the brow bone and I find my nose cute I used to hate it if there was something I had to change in my face, which I could change, probably add a little more tip because I don't know. I feel like it's not that pointy. But my dad has like a really pointy nose and I'm just like, why didn't I get it? My mom's nose mixed in and was like, girl, I'm mixing you with my nose. Honestly, I'm happy with how I look right now. Then we're gonna contour my face. Just to add some warmth. Another thing that I hated was this. This line. I hated it. Why do I have this contour line? It was so funny because like even if I didn't contour, I had it. It's because my face is really slim. And I hated it. And people would get RF to have that, whatever you call it, contour. I hated mine. It made me look hungry. And I always tried to do things that made my cheeks look fatter. I don't really care anymore. I even put more contour on it so it looks more crazy. But that's my face. And I guess I love it now. My point was, no matter what I ate, this never became, you know what I mean? I look hungry. So for blush, I like using this Tom Forge. So it's two colors. More. I just smile. And I apply it on the apples of my cheeks. And then I always kind of bring it up. highlight we're almost done just using this morphe b13 brush and what i like to do with this is i like to kind of like go in all three colors and then i like to apply it on top of my cheekbone and i bring it to my brow bone on the other side and then i use my fingers on the brown one and i just go on to my nose Next, I'm using the MAC Lip Liner. This one is in Real. I'm just gonna line. And what I like to do is I like to draw over the lips. And then the last step is my favorite lip gloss. Last step to seal everything in, I'm using the Codly. Face. Mm. Ooh, sa mata. Ooh, it's so minty. Take my beauty blender. I just kind of pat on the areas that I want to kind of like blend in. And this is like the finishing touches. So this is the final look. I hope you guys learned something new. And if you guys enjoyed this video, then leave a thumbs up and a comment down below of what video you want to see next. And subscribe to my channel. Bye.